All right, let's see. First of all, uh, inventory. I don't need you anymore. And I don't know why. There's one selected, but I need you. Look who we have here. A bridle. Hey, V. Good to see you. How's it going? Chuma mine earned a spot on the menu here. A chulo bowl with the bun? Yeah, I'm sorry to hear. Remember his drink? The recipe? Vodka on the rocks, lime juice, and ginger beer. And a splash of love. That's right. In the drink's name. A Jackie Wells. Right. Well, the first Jackie Wells is on me. Could definitely go for a drink. Tough day? I don't like any other. So, what'll it be? Uh, okay, yep, none of that actually. Friend that doesn't have enough money. Oh, that's where it starts. Let's talk. There we go. You ever need help with something? Just give me a holler. Let's not get too cocky, all right? You did Regina and I both a favor. It's not like we're about to forget that anytime soon. The life of a merc's got its ups and downs. Next time, it'll be me pulling you out of some colossal fuck-up. So long as I got the eddies on me, am I right? <laughs> Ain't wrong. Let's see. Uh, I was actually not going to do this. Fucking advertisement. Yep, don't want to look at your character. Uh, no, it's on the street just below it. So rather here. I did say I was going to, to look for those first. That was the purpose of this session. There we go. Now with luck, these are also in such a way classified that I shouldn't just accidentally turn them to dust.
I know that there's also somewhere one literally in the city be uh, beneath some scaffolding. So it is actually onto that terrain. And there should be just a body laying there. I mean this one specifically, I more meant this one. Right, yep. Those are the pants. Next one is actually quite close by. That supported crime. Just around here. Uh, I'll be doing the reported crime as well. But those are not seen as my cars, so... Let's uh, first get the jacket and then... Uh then grab the location here. Otherwise, you know... I might die a little bit quicker.
Right, get in. This is... Okay, reported crime in the water. I have to look this up by my PC for once. Not tall enough. Job, wait, what? Oh, 
There we go. And the next piece I need to get is, of course, somewhere in a diff completely different area. It's all the way over here. It's time to grab my car and uh, drive to the place I just marked. Because I want that le entire legendary outfit. Could be great if I have that. Would save me a whole lot of trouble of upgrading the one I have right now. I mean, it does mean that if I want to upgrade this legendary outfit to like my current level, uh, I do need to do some more work, but eh. And this is for one set of the corporate glasses. There's apparently two. I mean, I've already got everything at some point, and yes, there's definitely two. Oh, that's something that I will actually put into my storage, like the second pair of glasses. Yeah, I can just follow this. Not recommend it, but it works. Getting somewhere. Corporate chart. Which I've already seen as well now.
as much as I like this car, it doesn't handle this terrain very well. Partly also because car physics are kind of not existent in comparison. Well, they do exist, however, they're not, you know, as great as the ones, for instance, from GTA. Or some of the other racing games that I've played. Like, in here, they, they seem very... Yeah, I can go from here, just instantly cut through. Right, across the street from hell. Swipe some scrolls. Should be pretty spicy. Client's feeling generous too. What do you say? Intel attached. Don't make me beg. What's up? Uh, you know, same old. You? I got good days, got bad days. Same as ever. You, uh, called just to see how I'm doing, or...? Not just. Got a favor to ask you. Ask away. It's never boring with you. Interesting people aren't easily bored. No chance in your company. But now that we've <laughs> blown each other, what's up? You're on a need-to-know basis. So, this particular mission don't require you to have no gun. Just a wetsuit. All right, then. Count me in. But I gotta warn you. I look great in a wetsuit. Damn out past Rancho Coronado. Know it? Uh, sure, what about it? Little, uh, abandoned bungalow lakeside. Meet me there. At sundown. Okay. Uh, is this a date? <laughs> You're not my type, Holmes. Just show up. I'll see you there. So that's another job I will definitely be doing. However, that is also... What I want to have clothing-wise. I just need shoes and the other pair of glasses. Right, right there. And if I just go in the direction that I'm going right now, I start my fast travel station.
right here, other side of the river, or the bridge, technically. See one certain advertisement. There. There's a job called Violence. Job journal, please. Rest the body. At a place I can't see. Okay. I quite literally just cannot find. Like there should be a burning wreck there. There's no burning racks. Maybe I already got the shoes at some point and literally destroyed them or sold them. It's another old tab.
All right, great. I'll try fast traveling to a different location and coming back. If it doesn't show up then, then I have accidentally already looted them at some point, and they're just lost forever. Not that I, not that the shoes are really that big of a deal. Like it's just shoes. But uh, I would like to have at least some legendary shoes. Supposed to be right here. No, the, uh, the shoes are gone. Oh well. I have no clue when I looted those then, but still, it's okay. Oh, whoops. Let me actually on my PC a look if I can find something. No, I think you have to, I think you need to have done I fought the law. I think that's the issue. Which means that that is my next task. And honestly, with my upgrade and enclose already, I should be able to handle that. There we go. Job updated, violence.
And yeah, I do actually like to, to run for a bit. Don't need to always uh, use my car. Although often, yes, car. Someone here to see you, looks like. Huh. Wonder what about. You River Ward? In the flesh. V, right? My partner, Detective Hun. Okay. Thanks for agreeing to meet. You really intend to work with a merc? Don't know what I intend just yet. For now, I'm gonna see if I hear anything new about Ryan's death. You back on that? Boss already told you to drop it. Don't make him say it again. You know he hates to say things twice. And if you couldn't give a rat's fat ass about any of that, heed my advice. As your friend, just let the case go. Don't See me do anything? Be. Just sitting here, sipping coffee, listening to gossip. Fine. Do what you want. I'm not about to be part of this. Gotta go get my little girl anyway. And you two at least find a quieter corner. Wouldn't want to be overheard. Okay. Talk. Before the attack, you wanted to talk to Ryan's hustle. Get some info, dude. What was it? Let me ask you a question first. Why do you got your nose in this? Who hired you? Liz Perales hired me. And her husband, Jefferson. The presumed future mayor. <laughs> Guess I could have seen that coming. You know what? Han was right. Acoustics are a little too good in here. Got my car outside. Okay, sure. Uh, going to your car. Just for safety, I'll call my car as well. Some of the boys from the precinct oh. saw Horvath around Arroyo, shooting up dumpsters, um. hollering how he's got to meet with the mayor. Brought him in. Brought who in? Peter Horvath. Cyber psycho who attacked the mayor later. They took him downtown, but then he got lost before they could get his statement. Said he got lost. How's that happen? What's it mean? It means someone didn't want him counting roaches in a cell that day. And before you ask me, no. I got no idea who. My turn. Why is Perales looking at this now? Why does he want it done unofficial on the hush hush? Red Queen's race. Heard anything about it? Know what it is? Maybe I have. Maybe I do. It got anything to do with Ryan? The guy was headed there the day he died. <sighs> Fine. We're gonna see my CI. All I've heard is some fancy-ass club. No idea where to even look for it. CI might know. Then we'll go talk to the woman Horvath worked for. Or actually, we could see her first. Up to you. Let's go see his boss first. The guy who can afford all the chrome he was decked out in should have the scratch for psychomuting meds, too. We better check it out. Okay. Can't skip the drive, so. No, no, I can. A good 90% of any detective's job is talking. So, who are we supposed to talk to? CyberCycle's boss, you said? Christine Markov, 42. File has her as Horvath's sole employer. Sole contact, too, actually. Come on, V. Alright, I'll follow you. idea who we're looking for. Gonna have to ask around. 
I'll start from the left. You take the right. Yes. You Christine Markov? No, but I know who she is. Stand with the tech over on the other side. Christine Markov. Where will I find her? I don't know her. You buying something? Oh, not get out. You, Christine Markov, we have some questions. You badges? Looking for data on Pater Horvath. Worked here, apparently. Yeah, he did. Then he stopped working, started making fucking speeches all the time. These, uh, speeches, what did he have to say? Ryan, corpse got him by the balls and cock, but he still managed to fuck me. His motto. Why'd he have it in for the mayor? Ha! <laughs> Looking for reason in that whack job? Probably thought Ryan was talking to him through the TV, promising all sorts of shit, then ceasing to give a fuck. Look, I told you what I think. In Horvath's world, everybody was out to get him. Lucius Ryan was out to fuck him, then get him. Had no other connection, those two. Think hard. Easy money? That's what Horvath was after. Didn't do time for nothing. Worked for normals, not so normals. Maybe he and Ryan had some mutual friends. Would that be all, detectives? You're spooking my clientele. So Horvath. Oh, that's also the Max Street Ride. We might have guessed as much. Might seem like we didn't get a lot out of that. But sometimes intel makes sense once you've got some context. Say, for instance, somebody says they got a headache. Minor detail. Means nothing, right? Usually, sure. But then the guy waltzes straight into oncoming traffic. A neighbor remembers someone had worked on the air conditioner in the guy's unit. Guy whose head always hurt. Accident? Coincidence? Or maybe air dispersed poison? A deliberate hit. You actually caught a case like that? No. Made it up. Still proves my point. Fair. Oh, great. Let me handle this, V. Step aside, Lug. Your boyfriend got sent up for years. Doubt you want the same. Hey, gentlemen, gentlemen, chill. Please. Whoa, <laughs> <laughs> Jump, clown! Jump! Let's get this party! Jump! Fuck me! God damn it, V. Told you I'd handle it. Walking the streets with you? Downright unsafe. Got a beef with all gangs, or just the Tigers? I'm a cop. What do you think? Uh, gotta report this. I'll talk to my CI about your club, Red Queen's Race. Assuming you're still on board. You kidding? First, I gotta clean up the mess you made. We'll meet there. Meet River near as a informant. Sure. This is also the main HQ, which I could technically step inside and easily check out this mission. I mean, it's only Delamain after all. B, I need you to steal a certain document, and it's urgent. Find the details attached. Right, here we are. Uh, that's also you.
Well, hey. My guy works here. You go talk to him. I'll wait outside. Tell him Igor says hi. I'll know what it's about. All right. Wait here then. Fine. You looking for uh, general inspiration or something specific? Because I can help with both. Igor says hi. Fuck, no. Said I was done. I was out. Leave me the fuck alone, all of you. Ah. Fuck. Hey, Neil. Piss off. Relax. Just got one question to ask you. Nothing to see here, sir. Come on, ghost, I said. Leave me alone, got it? Can't make me do a damn thing. We can, actually, and we will. Just tell us where to find Red Queen's race. I don't know! So fucking remember. And make it quick. All right. Jesus. Chill, okay? It's outside city limits. Near the river. Benita Street area. You been there? Not telling you another fucking thing. Kiss my ass. Both of you. Well, well. That's what I call a breakthrough. Yeah, I'm fair. headed straight for Benita Street. Coming with? Yep. Sure. Thanks. I am happy to simply skip the right there. What are you instantly allowed to do? Come on, V. Wow. Animals turf. Any sly cop rules for talking to them? Scratch their tummies. Don't expose your throat. Ha fucking ha. We're short of warrant, so you're on your own. You find anything, tell me. Okay. like a normal body shop to me clubs here i'm telling you tell them you got a hunch cop intuition something like that
And then upstairs. Okay, it's definitely the bottom floor from what I can see. Hopefully you're somewhat out of visual range. In here I'm now safe, which is exactly what I wanted. Wrong choice, but still. Stairs inside. <laughs> Clever. So far, we're getting quite somewhere. Nice. Someone really wanted to cover up whatever it was that went down. What should we be looking for? Let's try to find something that looks like an office. Every club has one. Fair. Can you? Thank you. 
Body identified, enemies have been alerted. I can smell your fear from here. Hoping for them to stop looking for me. Well, didn't go the way I wanted it to go, but eh, good enough. me one heart attack that killed Ryan as I said from the start but someone spiked his BD that's what killed him fuck I think you could be right come on V 